Hi everybody, today I'm at the South Recreation Complex for our second vlog. It is a little bit windy, but I will do my best out here. Um, so the South Recreation Complex is one of the sport facilities that are on campus. Um, and it's located um, on the south side of Warrensburg. It sits on Marsh Street um, and DD Highway. And the parking lot is located on DD Highway. There's one parking lot for all of the different fields that are over here. The first field is the softball field. And this was constructed in 2001. And when the field was first constructed, there was a permanent seating installed, as well as bullpens um, in the fenced in areas. On the other side of the dugouts, they have dugouts. Mm -hmm. And then they also had a sprinkler system in the scoreboard first installed whenever um, it was built in 2001. This sprinkler system does help with the grass. And they also have to do a lot of upkeep because of the lines that they have to do for each game for the lines. They also have this little press shed over here. Um, on top of this main softball stadium, they have three additional um, fields used for intramurals for sorority and fraternity leagues, as well as just mixed teams for both boys, girls, and co-ed who just want to participate. And they have, yes, three of those, and they also have a little concession stand. Um, on top of intramurals, sometimes there are tournaments that are hosted over here for either the Warrensburg High School softball team host one almost every year, or sometimes the MIAA tournament is hosted here. Different things like that. Okay, and now moving over to the soccer field, as well as the building that was built with the soccer field. This building houses um, the softball and soccer coaches' offices, as well as locker rooms. Um, there are some restrooms and then different storage areas. Um, and then over here we have where intramurals play flag football as well as just two practice fields. They both have a little scoreboard. They both also have lights. Um, again, they both have returning sporty intramurals as well as um, women's and men's mixed teams. Um, the parking lot does have a few handicap. The parking lot, however, is gravel, um, but it is pretty spacious for hosting different events. Um, the soccer field was constructed in 2001, or 2002, I'm sorry, um, with lights, bleachers, and a scoreboard. Um, the bleachers can hold up to 500 spectators, and they actually got a newer scoreboard in the last couple of years. They also added this fence in the last couple of years. Many renovations have been added to the facilities and these renovations help to improve the experience for these events um, like more bleachers they also have some awnings over the softball fields upkeep of these two facilities takes a little bit of work um, just because these are both grass fields um, so they have to do their part to make sure the grass is good also they have a little bit more equipment like the nets. Um, oh, also, as well as um, just regular soccer games for the Jennies, uh, this soccer field has hosted the MIAA tournament as well as the NCAA Division II Central Region tournament. Um, both teams, the softball team and the soccer team, have had a winning record since they started playing here in the early. 2000s. That is the South Recreation Complex.